Year's Eve is almost upon us, which means ghouls and goblins are slowly beginning to appear at the Witch's Castle in Castlegar, an annual display put on by a local family every Halloween. The Witch's Castle is a tradition that first got started in 2002 by Stan and Beverly Ozeroff. We had it up at our house, which was on 28th in Castlegar. And Stan and I decided we would build a front for our house and start doing the Halloween thing. And it just kind of grew from there. Every year we expanded and every year we added more ghouls and yeah, it just kept growing and growing. <laughs> Stan and Bev continued to build on their display until 2009, at which time tragedy struck the Ozeroff family. Two, three weeks before Halloween, we were just starting to get things set up and Stan passed away suddenly. So we just, well, I didn't continue on with it at my place. It was just a bit hard to do that. That's when Bev's daughter, Carolee Pruden, stepped up and took over the witch's castle. Originally, she had just planned to do one final year of the display as a memorial for her stepdad, but that one year has now turned into four. I wanted to carry on the tradition uh, and do it for Stan, um, and I wanted to keep it in the community because people find it really important. Uh, so yeah, I was, uh, I was actually thrilled to be able to take it on. Um, the setup takes a lot of time, and every year it grows, and so it's about a month to set it up, and then like a couple days to take down. A key signature piece is the castle that was built by Pruden's stepdad, Stan. And each year the display is set up differently to accommodate for new additions and the old favourites. Visitors can expect to see a variety of animatronic figures and plenty of spooks. Carolee loves bringing the witch's castle to life each Halloween, enjoying the fun and fear it brings to the children in the Castlegar area. The kids really enjoy it and it uh, gives them something else to look forward to besides candy. Because <laughs> all year long kids will hear them walk by and go, that's the Halloween house. Um, and you know, I also, I, I enjoy the fear factor too. I love making the adults scream. It is the best part. We love doing it so much and Stan was a little bit of a ham so he was he was enjoying it a lot you know he dress up and it makes me proud that she you know does this f for Stan's memory and just uh, of course she's now gone crazy with it and it's become an obsession. The Witch's Castle is located in downtown Castlegar across from the Kinsman Park and is guaranteed to be a devilishly frightful scare on Halloween night. We are waiting for